here with Taryn McCall, um, seasoned competitor, if we could say that. Many share shows under your belt. Huh? How many have you competed in, do you think, over the years? Oh gosh, probably at least, I'd say, the last 10 years, maybe three to five a year. It's about 30, 40. Wow, that's pretty good. More. Yeah, so your last time you competed was in 2010? Yeah, 2010, two years ago. Yeah, and um, do you have any desire to compete again soon? I do. I feel like it's time to do something. I'm sort of not sure when. I'm, I'm going to just try and aim for something and then when the, the show comes up, well, there's time to get ready for one, I'll, I'll do it. Yeah. Maybe the INBA. I'm oh, okay, that's not too far away. Now you're still in great shape, you know, you're still lean, got your muscle. How have you maintained that um, for since competing? Um, well, I just try and eat clean most of the time. Obviously, keep up my cardio and my training. I never really miss any training. Um, never miss cardio, do it religiously every day. Um, basically, I just try and walk the talk, you know. Yeah, so you're teach, working teach as my a... my clients well, be an inspiration to them as well. Yeah, so you're working as a nutritionist now. Um, are you. Are you trying to encourage them to compete, or are most of your clients competitors? Or? Um, I'd say probably half and half. Half of them are competitors. A lot of them are uh, first timers, as in they come to me to get their eating right, and then I sort of give them a goal, as in, you know, would they like to compete? Mm -hmm. and nine times out of ten, they're really excited to and really would like to. So. that sort of gets them going straight away or gets them excited mm -hmm. and sort of go from there. Oh. oh, well, we look forward to seeing how your diet shapes up um, in a few months, huh? Thank you, Taryn.